Hey guys, this video is meant to show you how you can simplify your arch, uh, arch wire inventory by um, um, eliminating the need to order upper and lower arch wire forms. Uh, so what I found is that instead of ordering upper and lower arch wire forms where sometimes one, one arch wire doesn't fit uh, very well inside the other uh, and um, having to uh, fiddle around with uh, making uh, uh, the lower fit into the upper or the upper fit around the lower. Uh, what I found is a predictable way to do this is to just select one arch form, either, either the lower or the upper, and then just create uh, the uh, the opposite arch. So uh, what I what I do here, for example, in this case is uh, I take an 1825 stainless steel, such as this wire, and I like to select lower arch, for, uh, lower arch forms just because I prefer uh, narrower um, and more natural uh, intercanine widths. Um, so what I do is uh, I take the lower arch form. So here I have two wires that are superimposed on one another. And um, so what I'm going to do is um, I'm going to simply take one of these wires and I'm going to expand. Um, I'm going to expand across the premolar segment. So once I do that, expand a little bit, and then I overlay what I'm going to call this now the the upper arch wire form. Once I overlay that over the original. Uh, arch wire. You can see that I'm starting to get to a well-coordinated arch wire um, uh, shape. So I'm going to open this up a little bit more and just causing a little bit more permanent deformation in the wire. And now I think I'm going to arrive at an arch form that I'm pretty happy with. So you can see now that uh, the arch wires are pretty well coordinated and um, you know this is going to give you a nice uh, arch coordination and uh, like I said eliminate the need to order upper and lower uh, arch wire forms okay thanks very much and uh, have a great day guys